Popsicle told us to get some of these blue wax. Um, they're, they're actually jeweler's wax. And we're going to check our piston to dome clearance. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to take a little bit of cooking spray. And we're going to spray it on there. Now, we're at top dead center right now. So we're going to insert this long one into the spark plug hole. And I can feel the piston right there. And then we're going to rock. Going counterclockwise. Maybe. Nope, that's going down. Come back up. Okay. See how it's flattened? Let's see what that is with their calipers. Wait, stand still. Okay, Dennis, this is the way it came out twice. It's 0.14 millimeter. Stuck the wax in. We stuck the wax in there. That's what we did. Right. Yeah. And then we turned it over and rocked it back, top zit, dead center. Now, we had it right here. That is right. We had it right there. And see if you could push that down and make a, make a mark. There you go. Push. Yep. And that's what we ended up with. So it, it measured this side of the piston. Or squish. Uh, I don't know if it, if it, if it measured the squish or not. It, what it, yeah, you may be right. It, we'll ask. Maybe, maybe it did measure this part of the squish. Piston to head clearance. And we're not, we're at 0.045. And we're not supposed pistons. to be anymore. Our clean yeah, pistons. Aren't they nice and clean? Show me yours again, Z. Okay. So we'll ask, did, is it measuring this part of the piston? The angle of that piston? Or is it actually measuring, it's measuring this? this. It's measuring this edge. It's measuring the edge? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll ask and find out. Okay.